your will, lest you succumb to the void. This should be a good fight. What do you hope to accomplish? Battle 1. Fight. Now this is a fight I would pay to see. Hey guys, what's going on? It's Tico here. Bring you guys some gameplay of two of my character creations fighting each other. Marvels, not Marvels, DC Comics, Superman, The Man of Steel vs. Sephiroth from the Final Fantasy VII franchise uh, video games. So, in this two, this battle, you're probably wondering uh, why I would even put them up against each other. And it's, I was actually wondering who would win a fight. Now, you might actually think that, you know, Superman being Superman who he is, you know, he would automatically kill Sephiroth, no problem. But, I was thinking more about it in the in the aspect of, let's say, Superman was a weakened by Kryptonite. Now, before you say anything, I want to point out that Kryptonite doesn't actually kill Superman. It can kill him if in a prolonged state of where he is exposed to it. But there are different variations of how weak uh, or how affected he can become by Kryptonite. So, Kryptonite in some comics or some shows or maybe some movies might make it to where he gets weakened automatically to the point where he becomes as weak as a regular human being the moment he's exposed to even the smallest tiniest amount of kryptonite whereas in others you might, you might see him to where he gets exposed to a large amount of kryptonite and he only gets slower or he maybe gets it slightly weakened but he can still use some of his superhuman strength or you might see it where as the movie uh, Doomsday Superman, uh, I think Batman Superman Justice League Doomsday movie where he gets shot by a kryptonite bullet and he pretty much lasts the whole half of the movie uh, surviving you know until uh, the kryptonite bullet gets taken out of his chest and he still comes back alive from the he heals up automatically as soon as he gets taken out not even taken away from him just gets taken out of his body he automatically gets, gets healed up so let's just assume for this uh, battle that Superman is slightly weakened by kryptonite so he doesn't have a godlike power so where Sephiroth actually has a fighting chance against him now we really don't know what Sephiroth's capabilities are in Final Fantasy uh, Sephiroth is we can say that Sephiroth has at least peak human strength so he says at least peak human strength and agility if you are wondering what Sephiroth's agilities and abilities are I'll, prob I'll probably provide a link in the description showing you guys uh, a fight an animation fight versus Angeal and from the from one of the video games that Sephiroth is in so you actually can see exactly what Sephiroth can do he can jump great heights he can move he can pretty much fly with one of his wings his sword is probably the only weapon he actually needs to use uh, his sword can pretty much slice through entire buildings and uh, pretty much cut them down to shreds so we can admit that this sword is probably quite powerful we do not know what his sword is made out of but it, it can cut through buildings and it pretty much sends like a full shockwave that can pretty much cut through anything as far as we've seen uh, in the cartoons you know in the movies or in the animations we've seen from the video games Sephiroth has been depicted in other video games such as the Kingdom Hearts uh, series as pretty much the final boss that is uh, you know that's a secret final boss is stronger than even the final boss of the game so Sephiroth or Superman Superman vs. Sephiroth. Who would really win if Superman were slightly weakened by Kryptonite to the point where he could become vulnerable enough to where uh, Sephiroth might have a fighting chance against him? Sephiroth can also call down meteors from the heavens, and uh, he's made of Mako, I suppose. I don't know exactly what that is, but uh, Mako is a substance that is from the Earth, that's derived from the Earth, and I guess it gives him his power, and then he was born from it, and he's actually. Uh, Jinobas son, so Jinobas is supposed to be like a fallen angel, god type thing, so we do not know what his capabilities are, Sephiroth's, we know Superman's, and so let's just assume for this is slightly weakened by Kryptonite, so where Sephiroth has a fighting chance. So who do you think would win a battle, and what do you think of Sephiroth's skills? You know, uh, Superman can pretty much take a train, take a bullet, a regular bullet to the head, and he won't be killed, you know? But uh, so far, as far as we've seen, Sephiroth's sword can cut through anything. So, can it cut through a weakened uh, Superman that is not fully uh, immune to any damage since he's being weakened by Kryptonite at the moment? So, you know, let me know in your comments below what you think of this. And, uh, you know, this is kind of like a idea that just came from the death battle, a screw attacks death battle things. You know, I was kind of wondering what these two characters at those two points would look like and how they would fare up against each other. So, leave me your comments below. Leave me your thoughts on this idea, on this uh, what this battle would look like. And, uh, you know, make sure to leave me a like and a comment and, you know, that's all the good stuff. So, I guess that's all I really have to say for this video and I guess we'll catch you guys on the next one. Uh, make sure to continue watching the fight so you see what the final outcome is. So, I'll catch you guys later.
Adiós. The battle rages on. Stand up and show your strength. Find my battle. Fight. K.O. The battle has finished. Only the victor may proceed onward. You are powerless before me.